I have published this circuit a few days ago. Good quality tone control circuit, etc. And explained it already. And I want to make it now in a stereo amplifier. So here you see how this circuit could be, has to be developed in a stereo amplifier. Of course, this is one channel. But for stereo we need two channels. So I need a two 10k potentiometers, uh, two 10k for the loudness, uh, 200k for the high frequencies, and uh, two 1k for the coarse level. And when you want to make such a circuit for a real application, um, you uh, have to draw it completely out, and here we see the front from such a circuit. So volume right, loudness right, high uh, frequencies right, channel, coarse amplification from the right channel, and again here volume for left channel, loudness left channel, high left channel, and coarse amplification for the left channel. But uh, when you uh, me, want to make such a circuit in real, there are a few things to take into account. Uh, I use here a, wood, a wooden plate at the front, but there is a tin plate that's screwed into the front and all my potentiometers here are screwed to the tin plate. That uh, are soldered to the tin plate. That means that they all are um, on um, the ground level, and then I mean not all the electrodes, but the house of all the potentiometers, as far as they concern, uh, are connected to the ground. Anyway, want to tell something about this circuit? This is of course a mirrored circuit. That's important to tell. Here we have the front, but when we want to solder all the components together, the back side is a mirror from this circuit. So I want to keep it short. Left channel here, right channel here. Uh, the transistors are soldered here. On a piece of wood, a small strip covered with PVC glue, so varnished, and brass nails. And here you see, for instance, 27k, 10k, that's here, 27k, 10k, the caps, 4 microfarad, non-polar. As a coupling capacitor for the left channel, but exactly the same for the right channel that's here. My camera has to zoom in somewhat. 27k, 10k for microfarad, etc. etc. And I hope this is a little bit clear. And I want to stay now here on this. Uh, picture for quite a long time so that everyone interested can draw it over. Have to pan over somewhat. Input audio CD player. This template where all the potentiometers are soldered to have now in fact one and two or three ground connections. Could be that this doesn't work and creates a kind of hum, but anyway, when that happens, I remove all these connections to the one and only ground connection to the 
most sensitive uh, point in the amplifier circuit and that's here at the input. All the caps are non-polar here, here, etc, etc. I pan over somewhat. And I've done my best to draw it as precise as possible. Could be that there are some uh, flaws in the circuit, but I'm going to build it the next week. And I'm almost sure 95% that this circuit will work properly. Good quality audio amp good quality loudness control etc. The transistor from the left uh, channel, transistor from the right channel and of course this is the basic circuit. Wish you luck!